yeah, they use that same dog as uh, the play as the dog in the movie Little Rascals. That's interesting. I could tell because I recognized the spot pattern when you compare the two. It's like, oh. Did you actually it's look? It's Chiz. Oh, I, I would probably like. I would have to look this up through IMDb and see if it's correct. Yeah, the dog from uh, that the same dog that hangs out with Alfalfa. Yeah. In that one scene. Yeah. That's so cool. It's the same dog. You can tell because if you look at the spots on both of them, they match. It's insane. That's one of them. Yeah, Homeward Bound, that's one of the movies that I really love to watch. Screenplay Guru to level 14. Ah, that's another good movie I loved, The Little Rascals. I think if I remember right, that one has had Donald Trump in it as a as a celebrity guest. Oh my god. He also made a celebrity guest in Home Alone too. It's like, hey, which uh, Yeah, I was gonna say. It's like, down the lobby on the left. <laughs> no, excuse me, I have a wall to build. <laughs> No, excuse me. I have twenty. I have twenty more years to plan my uh, in my camp my campaign. <laughs> <laughs> I also like okay in the Little Rascals. That's also where they managed to get Wolfie Goldberg to guest star in too. I was oh, like, wait, wait, wait. Wolfie. Wait, wait, wait. I got something better. Hey, I got something better for Trump. Has anyone seen my invisible accordion? <laughs> what? An invisible accordion. Is that one of the parodies okay, like, that? Here's the thing, like. Is some of the some of the edited I mean, I mean, a lot of uh, Trump's speech videos, and like you see how he keeps waving his his arms like he was playing on the uh, on an accordion. They just put uh, they just put an animated an animated uh, accordion it is synchronizing with his hand movements. Okay, that's funny. Yeah, let me go find these videos. Fuck, dude. But you know, yeah, ages we'll ago be... I mentioned Pokey Fusers. It's basically trainers and Pokemon fusing into Anthro versions of. Nope, nope, nope. DeviantArt's got that covered. Uh, I don't need to see that shit. My mind, I can, your mind could go straight into the gutter with that thought. Oh, God. Yep, I know where that is. Okay. Also, um, Whoopi Gober, when she was in there, I was like, yay! I was immediately greeting when I saw that, because I recognized her real quickly. Hey, look, my mom's here. Whoopi. Hey, Jazzy, there's the video. Oh, no. Hang on. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Yep. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, what was the name of that little black kid from the Little Rascals? What was his name again? I think I know what you're talking about, but I don't know the act, uh, actor's name. I don't remember the, that kid, what that kid was supposed to be called. Okay, put that aside. Um, he also casts in another movie later on. Mm -hmm. What's that? Independence Day. Oh, that's... Wait, was he uh, the, the kid uh, for uh, Will Smith? He w Yes. Daddy, he was the Daddy, same little boy. <laughs> Mommy, look it. The earthquake. <laughs> no people are losing their shit about the quake. Little do they fucking realize there's a Martian outside, and he's all like, boo, 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 boo. Yeah, babe, you want this coffee, babe? Uh, boom, boom, boom. boom, boom. boom. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't care. What, okay, you know, I don't care what Doug Walker says. I love that movie. That is that to me. Is, that to me is like the only good movie from Roland Emmerich. Because his other I films think, are just yeah. filled with stupid, like, environmental propaganda. Oh, yeah, God it doesn't sound right knows what I'm talking about. Yeah, the movie's not what so bad. I love that movie. That was like, that's like one of the few, uh, enter universe, uh, et bleh, annual movies we would watch on Independence Day. Yep. Today, we celebrate oh, our Independence our Day. Our Independence Day. The probably the one and only good role from Bill Pullman. I loved that part. He played a, he did a great job. He was a movie. badass president. I mean, he, he looked, was. he looked like a 50 year old pretty boy, but he didn't stop at like, it just like kicking ass and chewing bubble gum. Right. You know what's the only movie. Hey, you know, what's the only movie that, um, eh, you know, what's the only comedy movie, uh, Roland ever in? What? Fucking hell. 2012. 2012? Oh, that movie was so stupid. Ugh. 
Yeah, okay. Oh. It, okay, funny story. It, okay, like, uh, you know, like, the movie 2012, which is based on the whole 2012 phenomenon. Like, we thought that the world yes. was going to end nine years ago. Uh, wait, yes. not, uh, like, seven years ago. But, um, I was at Barnes & Noble with a friend of mine. And we just came across a, a copy, a DVD copy of 2012. <laughs> and and my friend decided to put the, the DVD copy of 2012 in the comedy section. <laughs> That seems appropriate, because I'll... Yeah. Because it's such a joke now. It's it's a yeah. completely irrelevant movie. Yep. And we thought oh. it was going to be the one of the last di uh, last movies uh, before we die. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have to mention this. There was like a few quotes from Independence Day. Me and my mom both would still quote. Woohoo! It was one of the few I... I normally don't swear, but you know this what? I'm quote gonna requires it. This quote requires it. Good God! I've been saying it. I've been saying it for ten damn years, and I've been saying it, Miguel. Well, I've been saying it. <laughs> Hello, boys. I'm back. Man, I love that guy. He was funny. He was funny. Okay, what was that actor who played the uh, the tech dude? Jeff Goldblum. Oh, thank you. Yes, I liked his role in that one too. He did a great job. He was always the nerd. He was always that nerd adult who'd be in like every '90s flick, like Jurassic Park and then uh, Cats and Dogs. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> and then what? Checkmate. Checkmate. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I was in Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> <laughs> I better call my brother. I better call my housekeeper. I better call my lawyer. I uh, forget my lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I love that part. I love that movie. Me and my mom will never get tired of that movie. <laughs> oh yeah, no. It, it's definitely one of those movies that, to an extent, kind of lives off of nostalgia, but at the same time, it's just it's, it's it's a sip it's a fun B movie. It's how a fun the, guilty pleasure. How is the sequel? Because I know they had a sequel done. Uh we I've didn't need it. I've never seen it yet. I'm not gonna bother with it. I heard it I don't know how bad it was though. It has like a twenty seven percent on Rotten Tomatoes. Oh, that's sad. Ouch. Yeah, Jeff Goldblum was well also was well known as playing the characters from the Jurassic Park movie, so yeah. Life finds a way. Yeah. Yep. Shooter! Shooter! Yeah, uh, Neil said they did it. There was actually recently like they did an like Independence Rick Day Like Resurrection sequel. or something? It was just a sequel. It wasn't a reboot. Yeah, there was no need for it. Hmm. Yeah. It was... It, it, apparently, it wasn't very didn't get a lot of good rep, which was kind of disappointing, but their mistake was they didn't put Robin Williams... Uh, not Robin, Will Smith in it! Yeah, they didn't do that. Resurgence, that's what it was. Yes. Oh yeah, that was that was a really bad movie. Well, no shit, we were just talking about it. Another one, um... Didn't Shyamalan direct that movie? No. Mm. He directed The Last Airbender. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's a movie no one wants to remember. <laughs> Wait. I didn't know Independence Day was in a PlayStation game. Yeah, AVGN reviewed it, and it was fucking garbage. Oh, my God. Uh, what game does not get turned into a movie, I swear? No, not there what are some movie? good movies Wait. that are... There's Strike some, that. Reverse it. Yeah, no, there are some games that are worth playing based off of movies. Um, a couple of Disney games, like there's Aladdin. Well, yeah, most some of those movies were understandable to do. They did a good. The per, people behind those actually did good. Yeah, with because the it was fucking it. Capcom. They knew their shit. Exactly. Capcom. Whereas exactly. you know, you know, as compared to like fucking Puke Rainbow, who adapted <laughs> almost every goddamn major franchise that was in Disney. Well, except for Roger Rabbit, that also was an LJN game. Oh, Roger Rabbit. I love that movie. I still love that movie. Mm -hmm. uh, I need rabbit to... is 
Jessica Rabbit is the thick. Extra I'm not thick. bad. I'm not bad. I'm just drawn that way. <laughs> Why did you I do that? I still, every, time, every time I hear Jessica, every. Every time I hear Jessica Rabbit, and the more I, the more I imagine a freaking uh, Adagio being her. Oh God! Adagio? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Adagio. That's scary. Yeah, from uh, the, the si one of the sirens. Yeah, from the oh. queer trio girls. From the question girls. I heard that. <laughs> I heard that Equestria guy. Okay, that's probably actually a lot more funnier than I thought it was, but I don't know why. What, a queer Stria girls? Seriously, a Equestria guy, not cool! Okay, help me, under <laughs> help, help me under- He tried to help. keep himself from saying one word and turn it to something else! Ah, uh, god, god damn it! God damn it, guys! Screenplay guru to level 15. Hey, it's a manky! Yeah, and I just kicked its ass. Just kill the monkey. You beat it the monkey with a butterfly! Yep. He beat the <laughs> monkey. How I kick the shit out of a monkey? Imagine that. <laughs> I just want to point out that you guys definitely just said he beat the monkey. I got no one to blame Logic. but myself. <laughs> Logic! God dang it! <laughs> what? I mean, Pikachu. Yeah, I saw what a question you guys said. Uh... I am going to just proceed. No pony calls me boner. Right, boner? <laughs> no one calls me boneless. Right, boneless? Why? Because that's what she said, which says. Boneless. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, cheese sandwich. Cheese sandwich would have a, a cheese sandwich would ha would definitely have a a, a stiff a stiff chick. Uh, okay, yeah, he would name he would name uh, his uh, his uh, rubber chicken uh, boner if it was stiff, like very stiff. No, he wouldn't. Yes. E G corner. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't want to fish that in my head. Please, no. You have angered, you have angered the eight head? and or nine divines, depending on how you feel about it. You, you must pay fish? penance. You want a fish in your head? Is that what you said? Oh, cool! I got a. No, nugget. I don't want to envision that in my head. Oh, oh hey, trolls! No. Yeet! Yeet! I'm a fish with legs. My favorite part of playing Skyrim is yeeting trolls off the edge with shout. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> I think that's everybody's favorite part of the game. Alright, Sancho, let's see if you can take on this fucker. What fuck? I'm a fish. It survived? <laughs> oh no, it's the third one. Okay, as long as it doesn't get fucking poisoned, screenplay should be able to take on Ekans like nothing. Ow, fucker! Don't use Leer on me. Shithead. Get fucking wrecked. Oh, I get what Morpheus said. <laughs> F the rocket gang. I well, I don't welcome this mafia. Get him, hat girl. Get him, hat girl. <laughs> It's that game, that one game involving this little girl with the hat, with a top hat. I get it. <laughs> okay, Morpheus, you're getting a cookie for that. Oh wow. Cookie. Okay. I recognize you... the game he's based on. Okay. Um. You know what, Fox? If you find a Krabby in Pokemon, name it cook... cookie. Name it what? Cookie. cookie. Oh. Okay. But because why? the fact it says cookie in the top. It says it says like it's saying cookie in the anime. Why, why would why would you do that? Why would you do that? <laughs> yeah, because, because, because it's funny. Says cookie. <laughs> Krabby sounds like he's saying cookie. You could definitely hear it when you when he evolves. Yeah, he sounds like Cookie Monster. Kingler yes. Kingler sounds like Cookie Monster. He cookie, does. Cookie. Think about it. Thunder Wave. Okay. Uh, Pikachu already knows Thunder Wave, so I could save that for later. 
Oh yeah, Thunder Wave can uh, paralyze. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know about that, Derek. He's asking, can you name the Krabby Pokemon Mr. Krab? Mr. No. Krab. Oh, yeah, <laughs> no, you Mr. know what? Krab. You know what? I'm gonna. I actually have a better name for that. Uh, that crab. Solar 2.0. <laughs> Solar the second. Yeah. Solar the second. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> am I really gonna defile this gray for money? Of course, of course I am. I am. <laughs> Oh, okay. Desert Samurai pointed out, said something, and then um, it got me to remember what I used to Jesus. do when it came to Pokemon. Um, he says, "You know, I just what I just realized. Fluttershy using the stair is like a... Leer in Pokemon. It's lowers Are everyone's you fucking defenses." Me? <laughs> what? But yeah, base, uh, that's definitely a good pointer. <laughs> Sabuki. Um, but that also leads to one thing I used to do a lot if I ever caught a uh, Butterfree. I would nickname it Fluttershy. Okay. Oh god, you know what? Fox, you know what would have been really awkward if, if um... Uh, if what? Like, what if, what if they made a Pokemon generation if they were, if the region was based off Russia? Oh God, Aeon expect would have a be wall a with that. Expect Aeon. that, expect that to be a bootleg. Like all the Pokemon are just bootleg versions of other existing Pokemon. <laughs> Don't down, EG down. Wow, <laughs> I was just expecting like a theme that would sound similar to their anthem. Golden. <laughs> hang on. No, wait, 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 hang on. Let me find it. Like, this is. Here's how a Russian Pikachu would sing. Let me go find, <laughs> me go find it. No! Me... I wouldn't name it a. I wouldn't name a Butterfree Breezy. I would have saved that for the newer generation's fairy themed Pokemon. Uh, the new bug fairy that they have. Bombi. I would have nicknamed it that. Okay, this is how this is how Russian Pikachu would sing. <laughs> EG! We got the approval from Wolfhand. Look at the fucking emoticon he typed. <laughs> Wolfhand, don't! No! Don't be the traitor of me! Please! <laughs> that is the damseliest damsel voice that ever damsel. Shut up, Logic! <laughs> I'm a damsel. I'm in distress. I can handle it. Have a nice day! <laughs> cool. uh, Paperboy on the NES. I don't know if I want to play that or not. Like, I, I used to play it on Game Boy, but every time I tried to make progress, it was a struggle. Now Almost that theme like making song progress is stuck in a video game. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> go, fu go commit out of lie, <laughs> fucker. <laughs> God damn! <laughs> Rose well, Quartz is no damsel. Good no lord! Damsel. Who calls Rose Quartz a damsel? Do I need to educate <laughs> you in common <laughs> sense? I see it. I see it now. <laughs> but yeah, for what I played for my phone was um. It, on my phone was um uh, a scene from Russian Wee the Pooh. Oh god. <laughs> you yes. drop that image. 
Please, no! Oh, no, 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 like, Russian Winnie the Pooh looks pretty adorable. Let me go find it. No! I remember that! Yes, Columbia Pictures presents Winnie fucking Pooh. Of him. Oh, I got oh shit. my god! God damn! E.T. Season is eight. Have any of you? Any of it? Fuck you, Pete. <laughs> 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 yeah, season has it. <laughs>